What's good, you two? It's your boy Greg. Go crazy, go crazy. We are back here with another video. Yes, we back again. We still upload them. I'm telling y'all, before you do anything, go to press that like button. Go to press the subscribe button if you are new. When I say that, if y'all are new, bro, press the button, bro. Come on, P press the button. You know you're going to see my video again. Press the button, but just go on and press it so you ain't got to keep pressing it. And turn on the post notification bell so you'll be notified every time I post a new video. Now, as you can see, the gameplay in the background is from the Jordan Challenges. Now, I did watch a couple of videos on it. Now, as you can see, this is Michael Jordan in college bullying him. So, what that tells me is, is that he probably has the bully badge. Now, that bully badge is going to be OP. Like I said, look at this clip again. He just threw him out the way. Michael Jordan in college. I know his rating is not that high. But whatever his bully badge is on, he threw that man. He 6'6". Six, six. So, if Michael Jordan is doing that 6'6 six, six in college, I can't imagine what that bully badge would be like. So, just take that with a grain of salt. Now, the other thing I want to talk about is this defense. I mean, you see that defense? You see how it's red right there and then it's green on the side? That is a defensive line. Like, contested some just a little bit. It shows you how much they are contested. I like that feature, too. I'm going to make a lockdown. Now, as you can see on the screen right here, this is a 2K23 builder. That's official. That was from the 2K live stream on Twitch. Now, you see, this is the cold ring from NBA 2K23. That's also in the video, too. I'm telling y'all, man, I'm coming with the info. So, y'all just be ready. Now, Double H did make a tweet, and he said, after watching some 2K23 gameplay, I feel like those small play shots that side down span your moves for 10 to 24 seconds on the threes and twos in NBA 2K22 and 2K21 are going to hate this game so much. Not because it's bad, because a lot of you are not going to be able to adjust. Now, a lot of people cannot adjust to the new 2Ks. I don't know how, but I mean, it's just on them for real, for real. But everybody used to spam it left, right, being 5, 7, 5, 10 with Hall of Fame playmaking, dribbling as much as they want. They used to doing that. But I'm telling y'all now, from this gameplay, they is not going for none of that in 2K23. Lockdowns are back. I can't wait to get on the lockdown with Max Badge. It's going to be lit. I can't wait, personally. I can't wait. I'm about to change my build up. That 6 6 player I said I was going to make, boys, going to have to be some tweaks in it. I ain't even going to lie to you. I cannot wait. Friday is going to be a crazy day. A lot of people might mess up on their first build, but if you really work on your first build, you won't really mess it up. I mean, it really depends on you and how you play, but just really critique your build because you're not going to waste a lot of money on VC making all of these new builds. I can tell you that now. Not me. I'm going to go crazy regardless with the bills. Don't even worry about me. But, yeah, man, Mike Wang did make a tweet, and he did say, you won't lose boost in the backcourt. You should help PGs beat the press. When you run out of boost, if you pass the ball and wait off the ball for a few seconds, you'll get one boost back. Now, me, personally, if I run out of, that means if you run out of energy, you pass the ball to your team, and you just wait off the ball for a few seconds, you'll get one boost back. Now, me, I think that's a smart concept. I'm glad they implemented that into the game. Now, someone added Mike Wang on Twitter, and he did say, does losing adrenaline boost affect the speed of your shot? I don't know why he would add that, but I guess you just have to tell people some of the basics. He said, no, but low energy does. I thought that was a common sense, you know, common sense thing that you know adrenaline boost shouldn't affect the speed of your shot. But, hey, man, guess some people don't know. It's all right to ask. But somebody else tweeted Mike Wang and said, what about free throws? Would they be harder this year? Now, for me, I guess since the shooting is hard, the free throws should be hard too. He said, free throws are now more skill-based. So that means when you shoot a free throw, you got to really time a free throw. They're not going to bail you out with it slightly early. You might miss that. Now, Chico Filo made a tweet. He said, the best thing to come out of this adrenaline boost system for 2K23 is that every time you reach on defense, you lose a bar. This should stop every lock finger matching the steal button on every possession. Now, if you know how to play defense, this shouldn't really affect you. But I'm not going to lie. Sometimes 2K be cheating on the steal. If I deserve a steal and I press the button, y'all should give me the steal, bro. Don't do that if I make a lockdown build. Don't make lockdowns not useful. Now, 2K Intel did make a tweet. And they said you can get a technical foul or ejected for hanging on a rim for too long after a dunk in. Now, me... I'm not going to hang on the room too much. So I don't really care about none of that. Hey, that's what it is. That is what it is. I don't really care about none of that. 
But I'm just telling y'all, man, when Friday comes, be ready. Because the bill system is probably going to get crazy when we see it. When I'm dropping this video, it might be a day, it might be a month. But whenever the bill system come out, when you see this video, I'm telling you, please make sure you try to get your first bill right. Because I know it's going to be crazy. But yeah, man, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Subscribe. I'm going to say this one more time. If you're here and you're still watching the video, subscribe if you are new. We still like a grind with almost at a honey. And it's been your boy Greg. Go crazy, go crazy. And I'm out, man. Peace.